la la. Welcome back, YouTube. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. <laughs> Alright, guys. I just put that together off the top of my head. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, today we are back with another episode of Kingcraft. And if you guys did not watch the last episode, uh, you did not see my new skin. Oh, and I still have not fixed it. Uh, my new skin. It's not my permanent skin. It is my Christmas skin. So, yeah. Kind of like a sweater vest, I guess, and khakis. So, today, to tell you what we're doing, uh, first we gotta get prepared. I just realized that. We're going base hunting. Yes. We're going to try to find a... Uh, what are they called? Mega Taiga, Redwood Forest, whatever you want to call them, guys. So, I've been doing a lot of research, and I feel pretty confident that we might get one today. I've done, like, two, I've recorded, like, two episodes of these, and we have not, but, uh, I guess we have, or, what was I going to say, blah, 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 uh, I guess I did research about for an hour, like, starting an hour ago, so I just got done. And I think we might, because there's only one direction left, and, but, yeah. But since we are in the desert, with the new map generation, I mean, we have a snow biome, like, right next to this desert, but you're not going to see that very often anymore. So, yeah, it's, we got to travel quite a bit of ways. So, yeah, let's go into F5, and first off, I'm going to get prepared real fast. Uh, put that dirt away, I'm just going to use one of my throw-in chest. Put all this way and get what I need. Which, guys, I have a little present for you. I was testing this out. I didn't know if it would work. Uh, but I'm going to show you guys as soon as I get on the road. It's right outside my house. And I left a present for that damn dude of it. Because I, I didn't know if it would work. And I honestly, I bone milled a whole stack on it. And it didn't grow. But, yeah then there we have a whole bunch of beef so don't worry yes we're not gonna wait for that to cook yeah. and we have a lot of chicken guys because that dandy's prank left us with lots of chicken and yeah we have some beef I'm just gonna actually replace put that in there uh, OCD is killing me all right let's first off put that away 11 torches, that seems sufficient. Maybe one crafting table. Uh, we need cobble, 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 cobble. This is how I do most explorations, guys. We got our wood. Boom. Nether rack. Nether rack's a good marker to tell if we've been there or not. And yeah, ooh, obsidian. That'd be really important. That's really important. Ooh. Might need to pick up one on our way out, so that way we can get a full nether portal look. Uh, but yeah, we'll do that real fast. Is that all we need for now? I think that's it. Oh, armor. I just checked that. We do not have any good armor left, so we're going to have to make some new. And I know you guys saw the diamond armor, and they're like, why don't you use it? Why don't you use it? Uh, diamond, ooh, a voice crack there, I just realized. Um, but yeah, diamond armor is, n like, I never use diamond armor without it enchanted pretty good. I mean, I won't enchant everything at level 30. I try to. Uh, and once we get our enderman farm, because we're killing the ender dragon really soon, guys, that's going to happen next weekend, if you guys wanted a date. Uh, and I tweeted out a tweet on it, so if you guys didn't see that, obviously you're not following me. So yeah, go follow me on Twitter. And on our way out, we'll enchant like all this armor at like level one, basically, because we only have to pick up like a little bit. Um. So yeah, we gotta go get obsidian, and that's about it. And three, two, one, boom! That tree. That is the average tree in the redwood forest biome, guys. If you guys have never seen them, that's mega taika. Whatever you guys want to call it. That's a lot of sprucey woody. <laughs> so, if you just put four spruce saplings together, like, as a dark wood. Anything with four wood base, even jungle trees, I did test that. 
uh, it'll take forever in a day to grow, or dark woods don't take that long, you can bone mill them, but this, it took me an entire stack of bone mill, and then also you guys, I did finish the marketplace, I'm waiting for these to grow, which I don't know why that did that, Ooh, or that, but, this is Kralis' little chick, I could have done the three torches up, or whatever, but, Kralis does this, I think I might have to move the glass blocks one higher, but yeah, them two grew, right, and I replaced all that, we're gonna have trees surrounding this place, the marketplace, and yeah, yeah, my bookshop, which, uh, you can have two businesses on the server, this actually does not count as one business, well, for me it does, because you can rent this for me for like, uh, I think it's gonna be like an iron block per month or something, or like diamond per month or something, pretty low, um, and you can sell whatever you want in these, and actually, never mind, it's probably not gonna be low, it's gonna be decently high. I mean, I can be mega high, like a dime block, that'd be ridiculous for a month. Uh, so I guess I've been really under the weather lately, but I'm almost done with this. All I have to do is finish the can piece, and I'm golden. Or, we're golden. And I forgot to do the fountain here. Like the bush, and all that. Yeah. So, uh, yeah. Goku's, uh, rent a dome shop, which I actually have one. It's not quite done. Uh, you, you gotta pick out what color glass you want. I mean, it's kind of rent a dome with chest storage just out in the random open. Uh, I'll probably ask him to move mine, like, on the other side of their town. So that way, I can basically, because I was running out of chest room is why I bought one. And that way, like, when I'm over there, so I don't have to run all the way back over here and get one. So, yeah, that tree's pretty cool, by the way. I personally am yeah, pretty proud of it. But yeah, uh, last episode we built this tree, which I don't know why they're not loading in. Perhaps sucks for this. Chicken farm, I did revamp. And guys, I'm gonna be honest with you. Herb is gone. <laughs> we can't find him, so this will be Herb 2.0 up here. Um, and yeah, that's why you see baby chickens in there. And it comes down here into three large chests. I was gonna try to do something crazy and have like nine but I could not figure it out guys and look at that eggs I don't think three large chests is gonna be enough we're gonna have to like have a piping system out of these somehow I like the main problem is I don't know how to get it to like basically go from here without going under it go straight across like, I know to put a pipe there, but basically, like, a two-way junction, I don't know how to do. Uh, and that'd be really helpful if you had, like, a whole bunch, you know? But, if you guys have any helpful videos, post the link in the description, and that would be super awesome. But, anyway, guys, this episode will have a ton of speed-ups. Like... What happened to the other minecart? They combined... One has a chicken in it, but still. That's so weird. Alright, yes, I'm sorry. That is really loud, and I'm lagging my balls off. I don't know why. I have... I don't even have many things open. Uh, but yeah. Like I said, we're gonna stop by and get some enchantment. And we're gonna actually head off to north. I think that's north. Um, because that's the only way we have not explored. Or I, at least I have. I'm not gonna enchant my boots. Because why enchant boots? Right, protection one, protection one, protection one. I guess if I get a little levels, I don't know how I'm gonna get that small levels. Not amount of time. Huh. Well, you don't get levels for that. I guess I could have. Pulled out of some, or I guess it could smelt some stuff. Does anyone have some stuff I can pull out of furnaces? Nope, nope, nope. Dang. Oh, villagers. How many villagers are we up to? Still just three? Wow. They bridged once and haven't bridged since. I never uploaded the video for that because it was really bad on my end. Um, like the first time we tried, uh, was horrible. Like, we ruined the village. There was, like, I think three villagers. Oh, there, it's from the video. Like, three villagers left, um, from it, so we might find, like, there's only one villager left if he hasn't gotten killed yet. Um, but there was a whole bunch of villagers. I'm talking 30, basically. 
and we let him all out because we're gonna have him piped and stuff, and it was a mess. So then we did it again, which we, me or Daniel did not upload that uh, first one. It was by far the worst religious transport probably in history. See, all these are vacant. What the? Eh, it's not worth it. So I could run back. I'm not sure. But yeah, so we're gonna explore th this way. And guys, to be honest with you, I did explore this way. Like I didn't go super far. I never found it. I went like maybe a hundred blocks or something. But you guys will see this staircase I built because it's messed up chunks since it's going from 1.6 to 1.7. Oh, and by the way, there's an ice tray here for anybody on Kingcraft watching. Uh, there's a huge ice tray that you can come get ice out of if you shall please for the nether. Which I pulled a small prank, guys, on Dat Dan, dude. Um, I halfway filled up his nether tunnel. I ran out of materials like sand. It was just a random thing. I, like, filled it with a, maybe 32 glass or something. I just filled it. And then once I ran out of that, I did two stacks of sand, but his nether tunnels forever and a day long, so, that ended, if you're watching this, I love you buddy, <laughs> but yeah I guess, so, this huge ice tray, silk touch all this ice, that'd be awesome, ooh, what's down here, cool, but yeah, here's where I dug up, it's kind of a staircase, I kind of felt like I was playing 2D Minecraft, if anybody remembers that from back in the day, uh, 2D Minecraft, like a little tiny mod you could add on to your game and make it two dimensional. It was like two blocks wide, but you saw yourself from the side. Like, say, my guy was here, and it was like that, and you could dig down and stuff. So, oh. What? Oh, I remember I went up and over this for no random reason. Because I saw the roof force biomes over here. So, you guys, uh, I might do a speed up here. I might not. I know I will have a speed up. Uh, I might just do it when I'm in the water. Like, in a boat, I guess, because I, the reason I stopped last time was there was this huge ocean. I have my render distance all the way up, I think. Uh, yeah, 16 chunks, and it was ridiculous. Oh, that's throwing out meat. Make it rain meat. <laughs> uh, but I could not see any island, and I didn't have a boat on me, or any wood, for that matter. So I kind of was like, yeah, I'm not going here. So yeah, we will hit a roofed forest biome. Which, guys, if you guys were wondering where, what happened to the... I think it was supposed to be a dark forest. It actually, is the roofed forest biome. They ended up calling that... Like, it was supposed to be a redwood forest. Uh, no, it's not a dark forest. A black forest. It was supposed to be redwood forest. Um, black forest. Black forest actually became the roofed forest biome. Because... Uh, I figured that out today because it's meant to be dense leaves and stuff and all it looked it used to look like the redwood forest basically Just covered in leaves and it was really cool. Uh, I Would rather I mean I love the roof forest don't get me wrong, but I would kind of rather uh, Have them on both that'd be really cool like a redwood forest black forest and that Which guess I'm not gonna call it a mega tiger that no offense Jeb and Nitterbone that's not probably the best name. Redwood Forest, you should have stuck with. Because it looks like a Redwood Forest, obviously. But.
is so beautiful. Guys, mission accomplished. Oh, let's not drown now. <laughs> well, I think we got our Mega Tundra. Or Redwood Forest, whatever the heck you guys want to call it. Or Taiga, Mega Taiga, yeah. Whatever you guys want to call it. We have completed the challenge. I see the trees from here. Oh my god, it's so beautiful. I've never seen... Actually, never seen one in survival. <sighs> this crap tree, so I said, because we're still in Taiga. I would. Nope, there's some cobble. Yep, pause oil. Mega Taiga Hills. Ooh. Oh, huh. Taiga. Wow, Pod's oil looks amazing in survival. Looks better than it does in creative, if that makes sense. Is there anything in here? Nope. But guess we don't need all this. We have so much of it. Well, holy crap. My name is Sam Yol Jackson. <laughs> I'm sure you can guess. Uh, I don't know. Uh, what would say there? I guess mission completo. I'm gonna kind of come up on here. Well, guys, I know the last episodes have been a little derpy. Is this pretty much a wrap of the episode? I'm gonna make another portal. Don't you worry, guys. Because if I'm not gonna pipe all that, I'm not gonna go back that far ever again. I think that's about because I want it near pods on my portal. I'm trying to figure out where I want to place it. I could do it on like top of this mountain. And that'd look cool. That'd look real cool. Oh guys, I'm about to cry. It's so beautiful. This is amazing, guys. Look at that. Minecraft is probably I don't wanna break the leaves, so I wanna keep the natural landscape. Minecraft is probably the best game ever made of humanity and mankind oh yeah this is the dirt that doesn't keep grass growing on it like it won't grow grass that's cool like once you mine it it'll turn into another block but that's awesome place it right here the portal <gasps> i don't have flint steel uh, crap oh that takes me off so much you guys oh, oh dang it i don't want it right there well, guys, I guess I'm going to have to either go back there or just build a small little base here for now. Oh, do I have to soak touch pot oil? Oh, man. Makes me a sad camper. But who cares, guys? That is amazing. Oh, got one extra. I'll just put it dirt there. That way it looks somewhat like a full nether portal. And, yeah, guys. So, once I get a flint and steel, we can light this baby up. Or we might have to go all the way back there. That could be bad. That could be bad. That could be very bad, actually. Yeah. I don't see gravel for miles. Well, I'm not going to go all the way back, guys. I'm not that dumb. Well, guys, I think we're going to call this an episode here. Off my amazing fail. Lightning, please strike this. Please. <laughs> but yeah, yes. So, uh, let me do something here. F3. Uh, F5. F5. There. And then let's go F1. Well, guys. So, I hope you guys enjoyed. And, yeah. That's about it for this episode, guys. Yeah. This just makes me want to cry. I have spent so many hours and hours on this, guys. This is finally. Next thing, next two things that we really need to find are Mesobiome and like Mushroom. But yeah, I wonder if like they're close. I wouldn't think so, cause like, Mes or I guess Savannah would be cool too, since Stone has any yeah, cha cha wood. Um, but yeah, uh, they're not gonna be near this. I can tell you that because I don't know about Mushroom. Meza and Savannah are more in the warm biome or warm climate temperatures. Mm. Uh, redwoods are in the colder climate, so we're gonna have to walk a while. I'm not sure about mushroom. I think it's just random a bit. So yeah 
So guys, thank you guys so much for watching. As always, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, hug that like button, you guys, and smash that subscribe button. My name is King Cubicles. I got an awesome baseland. Podzoil is amazing. So yeah, I will see you guys later.